Hi guys, Dane here, and welcome to my November book haul. I have a load of books. Some of these are partially open because basically I've been ordering loads of stuff online, and I never know whether it's a book or not, so sometimes I've opened them a bit. But let's see, this one's open a bit. This is Shirley Jackson, The Haunting of Hill House, which uh, I want to read because I want to watch the Netflix uh, uh, original series of it. And uh, I mean, I've wanted to read this for ages and just never got to it. So I'm pretty stoked about that. Here we ah, okay. Here we have the official highway code, but it's the 2018 version. So um, I, I must uh, revise with this because, oh, I'm learning to drive. I've had five lessons now. Uh, I got into third gear the other day. Very exciting. If you're out in High Wycombe on Monday or Friday at 11 a.m., be careful. Okay. This. Ooh, that's nice. So, this is from Isabel Kenyon, who edited an anthology of poetry that I read and reviewed recently. Which I liked. Uh, so this is, here we go, fly on the wall poetry. She gave me a business card. She said, Hi Dane, hope you don't mind my sending you a proof copy. This was a test, so that's why the text falls into the spine. It doesn't anymore. The profits go to Shelter, Homelessness, and Crisis Aid UK. Crisis Appeal Globally. It's two charities. Hope you're still writing poetry. My next call is November for individual collections. Love, Isabel. And uh, yeah, Isabel Kenyon, Persona Non Grata, edited and compiled. Cool. Very nice. Graham Greene, A Sense of Reality. So Graham Greene's one of my favourite authors and I've been trying to just read through all of his books. This is uh, Four Stories. Let's see, let's see which stories. Under the Garden, A Visit to Morin, A Dream of a Strange Land and A Discovery in the Woods. Very nice. Okay, what's this? This is Terry Pratchett, Where's My Cow? A Discworld picture book for people of all sizes. So again, I'm doing the same thing uh, with Graham Greene, with Terry Pratchett. Pratchett actually is my most read author. And so um, really the only ones of his books that I have left are like these little sort of g more gimmicky ones, I suppose. But it's very exciting. The uh, If you've read the Discworld, basically Where's My Cow is a book in, in the Discworld that Sam Vimes reads to his kid. And uh, this is our version of it. Okay, this is What Matters Most is How Well You Walk Through the Fire by Charles Bukowski. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, I, uh, I, I uh, lent a copy of this to someone and I probably won't get it back. So I thought I'd just buy another copy. And then if I do get it back, I'll just give this to someone else. I didn't really make it clear whether I was lending or giving it. So that's my own fault. This is Duncan Ralston, Video Nasties. So Ralston is an indie author. He writes horror. Uh, we used to actually both be published by the same imprint, an, an imprint called Forsaken at Booktrope. Uh, but then Booktrope went bust. Not my fault. And <laughs> But yeah, so this is, I guess, uh, co yeah, a collection of short stories in the, in the vein of the old school Video Nasties. And uh, should be good. One for the indie read-along. Come on. This is Floppy Shoes Apocalypse 2, Cherry Nose Armageddon, an anthology of gruesome clown horror. So this is edited by a guy called Alex S. Johnson, uh, well also by Mary Genevieve Fortier. And, um, but the reason I wanted to get it is as well as being uh, edited by Alex S. Johnson, I'm pretty sure one of, my, uh, one of my friends has a story in here. Just got a couple of books in the post. Ah, turned up too much. Just got a couple of books in the post, so uh, we're going to see what they are. Okay, so this is The Strain by Guillermo del Toro and Chuck Hogan. And I believe it's a vampire novel. And um, I th yeah, I think it's like the first in a, in a series. But I've, uh, I've, enjoyed, uh, I've enjoyed a few of his, uh, his movies. So um, I, thought, I thought I would check out the book. So this is Black House by Stephen King and Peter Straub. I actually already had this. I read this while I was in Spain, but I can't find my copy of it. So I've just ordered another one. All right, so I can't really be bothered to set the tripod up. So we're just gonna see what this is. Oh, these are two things. This is uh, The Method by Duncan Ralston. 
It says on the front, Love is Pain. So Ralston is an indie horror author. I've read some of his books before and uh, looking forward to getting into this. And then the other one is uh, Deep Thinking by Gary Kasparov. So Gary Kasparov is the former chess grandmaster who was beat by uh, IBM's Deep Blue supercomputer. So yes, um, yeah. This is all about AI, well the subtitle is Where Artificial Intelligence Ends and Human Creativity Begins and Kasparov would know, so uh, yeah, I'm stoked, I've heard really good things about that as well, so I'll get to it soon. Alright, here we go. Yo, I've got some more books, so I'm going to share them now. Sorry I haven't set up my sign on my lighting, it seemed like a lot of effort to go to to talk about books, like just a haul, whatever. All right, here we have uh, The Employee Experience, How to Attract Talent, Retain Top Performers and Drive Results by Tracy Mailer, EDD, and Matthew Ride, JD. So I've actually got this for a client. Uh, this is the client that I'm reading business books and basically writing sort of 2,000 word summaries of the books. So uh, I've got to read and write about that one. <laughs> okay, I'm excited about this. This is Electric Dreams, The Collected Works of Jim or Paint It. So here is Brian Blessed punching a polar bear. Uh, basically, he uses Microsoft Paint to uh, draw things, and uh, these are some of the things he's drawn, so people write in. Dear Jim, please paint me John Lennon riding a penny farthing chased by a sausage dog. Where? Inside a Rubik's Cube. Thanks, Liam. So there we go. So yeah, excited to read that. As I've been following Jim or Painter on Facebook for a while. Okay, and finally we have The Future Workplace Experience by Gene C. Meister and Kevin J. Mulcahy. Ten rules for mastering disruption in recruiting and engaging employees. So yeah, another one that I'm getting paid to read and, and uh, write about. But yeah, lovely. Okay. And that is it for this month's book haul. So thanks as always for watching. Don't forget to let me know in the comments if you've read any of these books and if so, what you thought of them. Hit that like button if you've enjoyed this video. Hit subscribe for more and I will see you soon for another bookish video. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.